here today to teach you how to build canvases. Today we're going to get the uh, materials to build a 4x4 and two 2x4s. This is the 2x4 size, the dragon, and then the 4x4 is actually just two of those put together. Uh, we're going to go to Home Depot. I know on the last video I mentioned Lowe's and I apologize, I absolutely hate Lowe's. We're going to Home Depot. So we're going to load up the truck and we'll meet you there. Welcome to Home Depot. Welcome to Home Depot. This here is my dad. He's going to help me. This is what I call cheap labor. It's free. If you got you one, use them. They're great. Say hi, Daddy. She don't got it. <laughs> okay, come on over me. here. I want you to see some of these prices. See that? See that? See that? Nice wood, right? Real nice, right? Look at this part right here. <laughs> cheap. Exactly. It's cheap. This is what we're going to be working with is this wood right here. This right here. Cheap. This is cheap. Now hold on, baby. Let me see this. If you could. This right here is 8 foot by 4 foot. Okay? So just imagine how many pieces you can get out of here. You can get two four by fours. You can get one, two, three, four, two by fours. And you get a whole lot more two by twos. So all of that for 10 bucks, you can't beat it, all right? So we're gonna load this up and I'm gonna show you how to get the studs for the back. All right, all right, now we're at the studs. Can you see this price right here? This is what we doing. This right here. Cheap, right? Okay. These are studs. These are one by two studs. These are going to go on the back, which creates the frame, which is how we hang it up without needing to, to purchase a frame. That's way too expensive. Um, this is cheap wood, so you do have to put in a little extra work to get you something that's nice. This is an example of like out of control wood. You do not want these pieces. If it's bold, this is a perfect example of a bold piece of wood. You don't want this. It's impossible, absolutely impossible to work with. This one's only slightly bold. You might not even be able to see how bad it is, but when you go to put these on your canvases, it's going to warp and bend your canvases, and they're really hard to work with. So open up a bundle if you need to, and just try to find some pieces that'll fit. Now these side, these uh, one by twos actually come in. Um, they're eight foot long, so. You really don't want to cut them because you want them to fit the canvas that you're actually going to make. So we're going to open up a new bundle and hold on, let me, let me see if I can show you all. Come on over here, Chantel. I'm a visual learner, so I'm going to show you what I mean. Mm -hmm. But these one by these studs are actually the same size as the canvas. All right. So we want to leave them at their true size. So when we would go to build. It won't be, uh, it'll be one full piece, okay? So that's how you go ahead and measure how many you need because you can see that it's going to take one stick to go across the top, one whole stick. It's going to take two sticks to go across the side, and you're going to have four sides no matter what canvas you build. All right, so we'll go into more detail and I'll show you what I mean, but just go ahead and buy these at their true size. Pick out enough uh, to make your canvases that aren't bowed. And, uh, We'll go ahead and cut the wood and I'll show you how we do all that in just a minute. All right, now we're having the wood cut. Uh, we're going to get one 4x4 four four, and then we're going to get two 2x4s. Two uh, I love Home Depot because they there's always somebody to cut the wood and the machine always works. <laughs> Take notes. Please don't go to Lowe's. Save yourself the trouble. Yeah, he liked that. All right, cool. Okay, so this is our four by four. That's the largest canvas we've got. And then we've got two two by fours, okay? And then we've got six one by two studs. And this is the price. Oh, 
For those of you that can't see it, fifteen dollars and forty-seven cents <laughs> cheap, right? All right, cool. Boy, do I feel lucky. I happened to go to Walmart for some other art-related projects, and I just wanted to show y'all. Look at this. Get a look at this. This is Oops Paint, even at Walmart. It's called Miss Tense, but this stuff you'll see is. 50% off. This can of paint, it's like you can see it's a little green. I'm sure you could find something to do with green paint. $3.48. It's out of control. These ones right here, this is a mix, uh, mist tint. I don't know what color it is, uh, but it's 50% off. $31.50. And this one right here, this is, these are five gallon paint buckets. This is $20 for five gallons, you know? This is the type of stuff I'm talking about. If you want to be a true artist, you really want to create and stay on a budget, this is a great place to start. All right, so um, still checking out how to make the canvases. Just wanted to jump in and show you this one. But uh, we'll be back. I'll meet you at the house. Welcome back to the studio slash garage slash no rent place where I work. Okay. Um, here's the one by twos, and then here's the wood that we've got. Okay. We're not going to build today, but I am going to show you the rest of the tools that you need to gather for the build. Um, so I just want to talk about storage. It's very easy for your wood to become warped, so make sure you store it somewhere where it can sit flat so it'll be ready for you when you build. The 1x2s are going to be stored right up here. It's high, it's away from water, it's away from anywhere that can damage it, and it's laying flat, okay? And the wood's gonna go, it's gonna slide right in here. So we've got that sitting tight and pressed up between some other things so that it doesn't get warped. We can leave it there as long as we want, whenever we're ready to build, it'll be flat and ready for us. So uh, if you all have any questions, let me know uh, about the tools, about everything I'm going to tell you about. But we've only spent $15 today, and we're going to get three canvases. I mean, it doesn't get any better than that. And later on in the week, we'll start building the canvas, all right? Uh, hey. yeah.